right, first item up this week is the Pyromaniac with uh, max weapon damage here. Now, with the combination of the optimization table and the recal table, you could actually make this into a good weapon. Um, Pyromaniac fires absolutely smoothly based off that uh, M4. Um, and everything else here is not worth your time, um, be honest with that. And let's go ahead and speed run to the clan vendor and see what is up. All right, here at the clan vendor, the first item up is the chain killer. Um, nothing max on here, so it won't be a candidate for uh, the two stages of re-rolling. Um, we will talk about that uh, that optimization table in another video. Um, but everything else here is really not anything special. Uh, you could farm for all of this in the open world, which is what they want to do uh, with this new update here. TU-12. All right, let's make our way to the theater here. At the theater, the first item up is the artist tool. Definitely a nice gun. Um, I would farm for a better one. You definitely can get it out of one of your packages. Um, Nothing else here is going to be particularly good. Uh, so we are going to go to the campus settlement. All right, here at the campus settlement, first item up is the new uh, marksman, the scalpel uh, with future uh, perfection on it. You can see here that uh, weapon kills grants one skill tier. Now, here's my thing with uh, with uh, skill builds and, and killing an enemy to grant a skill tier. When you have a skill build, typically you have absolutely no weapon damage. Um, so it will take you forever to get uh, some skill damage to uh, do a kill and uh, makes it not a great item to have in your build. All right, DZ West. DZ West, we've got a Harmony. We've definitely seen better here. Um, I wouldn't pick this up. Everything else here, let's go ahead and take a look at. Um, nothing that is remarkable. Nothing worth your time to go ahead and optimize and recal. Now, remember, you're going to need to do those two stages. So you definitely at least want one of your items to be maxed out. Okay, swap chain here at uh, the DZ South. And... God, nothing special. Um, so let's keep on going, and we're going to go ahead and go to the DZ East here in a second. Um, now, I never look at the mods. I'll remind you, don't waste your time on the mods. Just go ahead and uh, make them yourself or find them in the open world. White Death, the first item up. And, of course, nothing here special. That Negotiator's Mask has a decent amount of... Um, weapon damage on it and the aces definitely has uh what you want on it which is headshot damage the aces is not of course what it used to be um when it came out um so let's go to new york and here at new york we have no named items just a reminder um take a look at a couple of these items here and i would be impressed if we had anything special here at new york Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at the second vendor. Yes, two vendors at New York. Both of them have different items. All right. So first item up is a converted SMG9. Um, nothing special with that. Uh, I will continue to say that nothing here. Oh, wait. Those gloves are maxed out. You, uh, I would farm. I'd still farm for these gloves. Uh, you could, on the optimization table, max them out. Um but I wouldn't. All right, so let's go ahead and look for our girl, Cassie Mendoza. Cassie Mendoza, first item up is a designated hitter. Um, then we've got a strategic alignment and then a shield splinterer. Now the shield splinterer has got uh, better than better than average rolls. Um, we haven't seen her with uh, these rolls in a while, um, but definitely not the best rolls we've seen her with. Um, rigor backpack there. And then everything else here is not really special. Um, I will say that uh, these negotiators coming up, this mask is a lot better than the one that we previously seen earlier in the video. And with that agent, uh, we're going to call it a week.